Hey everyone, it's Helper Joel here. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create level roles in your Discord server using ArcaneBot. First thing that we're going to do is add ArcaneBot to our Discord server. We can do this by going to the top left and clicking on the server name, going down to the app directory, searching for Arcane, selecting Arcane, hitting the blue add app option on the right, making sure we have the correct server selected, and then hitting continue. Just going to the bottom of this and hitting authorize. Confirming you're a human. Now we can go back to our server, and our cane bot is now added to our server. After we've done that, we're going to now create the roles that we're going to get for these different levels. So just go to the top left and click on your server name again. This time select server settings and select the roles option on the left right near the top. And you're going to go and create a role. And you don't have to create a role for every single level, but you should at least do the big levels. I'm going to do level one, give it a color. And I'm just going to create a few different roles for different levels. One important thing to do here is make sure that the arcane role is dragged above all of these level roles so that the bot is able to give these roles to the members. After you've created all your level roles, you can now exit out of this. And we are now going to go to our browser. And we're going to go to arcane.bot. And this is going to bring us to the Arcane website. From here, you're going to log in using your Discord. And after that, you can select the server. And once you're on the server's dashboard here, you'll see the option that says leveling. You're just going to hit configure. And then from here, the first thing that we're going to look at is the level up message. In this first box here, you can select what text channel you want the level up messages to be in. I'm going to select general, but you may want to go back to your server and create a new text channel specifically for these messages. There's also the option to customize the level up message here. I'm just going to leave it as the default, but you can feel free to change that to whatever you'd like. And you can use these tags up here to have it more customized. After that, there's a few more options that we're going to scroll past, the voice leveling, voice XP options, and the auto reset. You can decide what you'd like for those. You can customize the progress bar. But the next main one that we need to look at here is the roll rewards. First thing we're going to do is turn off the stack rewards. This will make it so that you only have one of the level rolls at a time. After that, we're going to start with the first level roll that we have for level one. We're going to select the roll here and choose the level one roll. After that, we're going to hit the add reward. And we're going to do this for each of the roles that we have. After you've added all the level rules, you'll see them all on the left here. You can see that they all match up with the level and the role. So after that, we can scroll down. We can select certain channels and certain roles that won't be able to collect XP. But after this, we can go back to our Discord server. And the level roles are now set up in our server. I hope that this video helped you guys out. Please remember to like and subscribe.